Why do you guys know that song? That song, yeah, song should have went. Platinum. It's in my DNA. It's in my Dana. Okay. What's that? Dana. 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 Why you uh, up? Aspen, still stop begging for food. Call me fool. I didn't call you fool. I said fool. Why you still up, fool? Hmm? Why you still up, fool? Because I'm eating fools. Oh. You said fool. Fool. Blaze the lollipop. Seriously. I'm living my best life. Ain't going back to book for two. We interrupt our program to bring you this important message. Who owns Victoria's Secret owns like five other companies. He stole from that man. He's supposed to be handling his money. He stole over a billion dollars from that man. Then he goes on. Then he goes on and start working with other people, start selling money from them. That's how he is famous. Okay, let's this say it takes him. This is two thousand and one. Okay, when he has all this money, he starts going into different cities and start buying houses, start setting up shop. I guess <laughs> setting up shop, and then he starts trafficking women. That's how he got put on. In the midst of trafficking and starting with these women, <laughs> he buys off the police station in every single place that he that he put up shop houses. Then he gets a personal island that he brings celebrities to to will them in. Because if you have workers there and you see a celebrity there, you can obviously attest and have them attest that, oh, yes, they were definitely there. So why are you trafficking women and still using these people's money and you have workers to see these people over here and famous people over here? That's extra loot in your bag. So that means if I go down, you go down. Because guess what he also did? This man is smart. He opened up a book. And every time you got on his jet to go anywhere with him, you're signing your name. Not the underage women, of course, though that would be stupid, but the famous people. So we got Bill Clinton. I did not have sexual relations with that woman. And we got um, the guy that worked with Jackie Chan, the black guy. Chris Tucker. Chris Tucker. Do you understand the words that are coming out of my mouth? Chris Tucker. Chris Tucker, name written in there. We got Obama. The imperfections of man. And the limits of reason. He got a whole oh. book of famous people. So imagine a book full of famous people hanging out with Jeffrey Epstein. And Jeffrey Epstein knew what he was doing. This man is smart. Ooh, I kind of like this nigga. I like this nigga. I like this nigga. Like he was he, hey. he was a mastermind. You cannot deny he Yo, was a mastermind. When the corrupt fuck over the corrupt. That's a win-win. That's a win-win. <laughs> yeah. So when he went to prison... So when he went to prison, the, the theory is somebody put a hit out on him. Because if he's going to court and he can't get out of it, his money doesn't help him anymore. They killed him in his prison. Some people try to say... In oh, his he, own prison. In his own prison. Some, Some people... Pablo? No, no, no. Jeffrey, Jeffrey Epstein. Epstein. Some people say that he killed himself. No. Nah, he when didn't. When they did the autopsy, it showed that somebody was strangling him from the back. So... This he part died? of his neck crushed Yeah, he 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 died in prison in August last year. Yeah, it's 2019. It was super, super recent. And I'm pretty sure when they got that book, they started checking people off one by one. Even though they killed Jeffrey Epstein, meaning that he knew a lot more people than he was alluding to, it was probably going to rat out to him. Of course, because that's his collateral. Exactly. Probably wasn't going to get his money. Once your money stops working, that's what happens. Six, nine. Once his money stopped working, he gets name after name after name after name after name. After name. And then he got off. Then he probably would have got off and continued to live his life. But... I'm just sitting here like, that's crazy. Y'all waited until his money couldn't do nothing for him before he gassed his name out. And he's like, okay, cool. And what was even weirder, the way he set up. Okay, we all know why R. Kelly got caught, right? Y'all killing me with this
Like, he kept messing with the same people. He kept messing with the same girl, locking them in the house. No, no, no. Jeffrey Epstein did nothing of the sorts. Jeffrey Epstein said, if I picked up this man, right? And I was like, oh, you're struggling. I'm going to give you 500 right now to massage me. Okay, I sex you, arrest you, send you on your way, and then I call your phone and be like, I'll give you $1,000 if you bring me two more men that look just like you. Hang up the phone. You can either do two things. You can either be like, no, nah, I don't want it, but I do need the money because I'm young, I'm poor, and I'm impressionable, and I don't get the abuse no more. I'm just going to slide this person over two more people. Slide this person two more people. I called them two months later saying, I'll give you $1,000 to give me two more people. And he kept and kept and kept and kept going. The top router people are the people who wanted the most money from him or felt like they could not live without him. So say if Juwan felt like he needed to stay around and he didn't have a place to stay and he felt like, oh, whatever is happening is like before he met me, I'm still giving this man money. I got money. I got live in a nice place. And I got boats, trains, hotels, police force behind me, this and third. I keep you around. Don't ever show your name or your face when, you, when we're out there. Like, you're just so handing me people in and out, in and out, in and out. We only have like four people on top like that. Four people versus R. Kelly who have like 16 girls out on the, in his house locked up. That's where R. Kelly does go. Because he had females that stayed around for years and years and years. Where he only had maybe four females that st stayed around for years and years and years. Crazy. I was like, yo, it's a spider web of people that he abused. And they're all over the state, city, country. I was like, yo, this man couldn't be caught if he wanted to. But they just as dirty for going along with it. But they were young. Imagine somebody coming up to Melody and being like, I'll give you $2,000 to bring me two girls that look just like you. Ma'am, ma'am, no, ma'am. You awful. <laughs> and your mom is also on drugs. You never seen your dad. But I'm not. With 12 siblings. Um, with yeah, 12 siblings. 12 you know. siblings. My G, 2000. Bro, and you just moved to New York or something crazy like that. You, you oh, bring think... her up there. I got to get the back. Exactly. What? Look, you may think like that shit is like you will never do it or nobody will ever do that shit. But when you in a low place in your life. Yeah. You in circumstances. Anything, yeah. yeah. Yeah, that's, that's how they what, pray. That's, that's what make them people not want to speak out because of being in that low place. Yeah, yeah, like, and that's what's protecting them. Yo, they know how to pick them. Exactly. That's and then on top of if you come out and I keep in mind now, I own the police station. I own whoever the president is. I probably own any stations and things like that. I harass people at stations. I give away your name. I give away your face. I give away whoever is next to you. Who's everything about your life is in public now? Just because you said something, you said something about it. true or not true. And then on top of that, they don't call you a sexual victim. They say you're a prostitute because on top of that, you did get money from me. Mm. I did make your life. I did give you that job. You are a prostitute. Mm. Like this man was smart. He paid everybody off. He paid everybody like off. Then he what? Paid everybody off? No, I, I I don't like the part about him with all that other wicked shit. But him fucking up the company, I like that. And having companies get bankrupt, cause fuck these companies. <laughs> yeah, he had an agenda. I like that. He, part, but yeah, yeah. But every, his personal shit. Hey, guess what? You're it was just a sick. Person. Yeah, that was sick. Okay, Dolly went in on Jeffrey Epstein. Bloop. Thanks, you guys, for watching the video. Like, comment, and subscribe. And don't forget to share the video.